PCDC's Performance Improvement Team provides capacity building and coaching services to primary care practices and other healthcare organizations across the country. We're working with a whole range of practices, including smaller primary care practices, federally qualified health centers, hospital systems, among a range of others. At the core of our work, we're working towards supporting these practices to really achieve higher patient-centered outcomes. Patients should be receiving the best care at the right time in a way that works for them. We're often seeing that these practices are achieving other outcomes as well, improved provider satisfaction, lower costs, and improved patient outcomes across their entire patient populations. At PCDC, we're all about the personal touch. We tailor our work to the goals and needs of each of the practices that we're working with. So we spend time at the beginning of engagement, making sure that we establish and understand the needs that each of our clients are looking to achieve by partnering with us. We oftentimes will spend time on site at a practice, observing their providers and staff, and working through a work plan and an approach to training and technical assistance that really works for that site. So the great thing about the performance improvement team is that all of our staff have worked in the primary care setting in the past. They've come from a variety of backgrounds. We have people on the team who are licensed social workers, we have people on the team who are nurses, we have people on the team who have been practice managers at primary care sites, and they really take that experience on the ground into the work they do on an everyday basis for us on the performance improvement team. This means that they really understand the needs of the practices that we're working with and we can create tailored engagements based on those previous experiences that our staff have had in the field. So our performance improvement team provides services on a whole range of issues. Some of them are related to clinical issues and others are related to operational issues that affect primary care practices and providers and staff on a day-to-day -day basis. So we're working with providers on anything from integrating HIV prevention best practices into their setting to improving care coordination services amongst their care coordinators to really implementing a full-scale patient-centered medical home recognition process. The practices are working in a way that patients are receiving the right care at the right time in a way that works for them.